seem really interested in us. Oh yeah, checking us out. But we're not that cool. You guys are the cool ones. Do you understand <laughs> that? <laughs> talk, talk about They do! A trainer here at SeaWorld. Well, I just met Drew and I feel like he likes me. That's already. right. I think, I think you're in. I heard that they're not technically whales. Is that true? They're the largest member of the dolphin family. Oh my goodness, yep. you're a big <laughs> dolphin. Can you see my bracelet? Can you see? Yep, kill whales have excellent eyesight both above and below the water. Yep. So the eyes are located right beneath. You see that white eye patch there, Lisa? They're located yeah. right in the front. Yeah, I see. I see. So kill whales are mammals, right? So they breathe air from their blowhole. Mm -hmm. So how we train a blow culture is, we will actually ask the animals to take a breath. Okay. So when they take that breath, we're able to collect that breath inside a petri dish. Oh, so wow. we'll hold that right over their head, they take a nice giant breath, we collect the sample, and then our veterinarians will monitor and study it down. I never thought collecting mucus would sound so fun. So Lisa, if you look to your right here, this is Kayla, okay? Kayla, Kayla she is a full-grown adult female. Okay, so she's weighing about 6,000 pounds. So oh eventually, goodness. Trua, he's going to be twice the size of Kayla here. Wow. You're going to be a big boy, aren't you? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Down there, we have Malia. Now, Malia, yeah. she is nine years old, and she's getting close to about 4,000 pounds. Oh, Malia. You're such a big girl. <laughs> oh, my goodness. <laughs> And you're down here for so long, how long can they hold their breath? Eight to ten minutes and even longer some. Oh wow. So. so what does it take to be a trainer? Now a lot of us, we have a background in psychology, believe it or not, or marine sciences. A lot of the stuff we do here with the animals is behavior modification. All of our training is based off positive <laughs> reinforcement. So when the animals do something we like or we want to see more of, we draw a lot of attention to it. Okay. Whether it be through uh, <laughs> fish, toys, rub downs, relationship building, yep, all those different I things. I want to get some rub downs when I yep. do something good. <laughs> Come on. All right. When you have a dog, you got to take them for a walk so they right. go to the bathroom. What about these guys? They, they're able to do what they need to do inside the facility <laughs> here. Our total facility here is almost 8 million gallons of water. Keep in mind, it is filtrated every three hours. We have an entire water quality staff that's in charge of making sure that the water is clean and healthy for the Oh. So I heard that sometimes you have to get urine samples. We do do urine samples. How? So basically what we do is we have a cup. Okay, this is pretty cool. No, wait. When you say cup, you're going like this. Just Shouldn't flat. it be a cup like this? Yeah. <laughs> so we have a basic specimen cup. Really? Okay? And what we'll do is we'll just sit here and hang out with the whales. Then, when they, when they are urinating, we will actually show the cup. They'll learn and understand when they see that cup. What that means. To try to get Oh my goodness. And then we'll so generalize that to the surface where we're able to collect the sample. That's amazing. Pretty cool, huh? Joe, thank you so much for introducing me to our orca friends and playing with us today. Absolutely, Lisa. You know, we appreciate you coming here and hopefully by learning a little bit more you're inspired and to care more about killer whales just like our guests are. And, and that's our main goal. When, when guests come to our park, we want them to be inspired and to go out and care for these animals. So we hope when they visit us here, they want to conserve and care for these amazing animals, just like we do. I think I have some new friends. <laughs> oh yeah, you too, Joe. Oh, thanks. <laughs> Give us a like if you learned something new, and visit bestoforlando.com for tickets. Then subscribe, because next time, I visit an animal that mostly eats calamari. I'd love that diet if it wasn't raw. <laughs>